last second of the basketball game, and uh, uh, I, I didn't even get a chance to, to shake uh, Coach Bonnie's hand after the game because we were concerned about uh, Jamie. Um, and like I said, we had to carry him off into the locker room. So, uh, you know, you, you never know the seriousness of injuries until you can see the next day. I think that, you know, tomorrow we'll find out if he's got a lot of pain and such. Uh, can he walk? Whatever. It looks like a calf or an Achilles issue. I'm not sure, one or the other. Um, and I, I don't want to, I'm not a doctor, so I don't want to make a prognosis. So, but, you know, we'll get him to the doctor uh, tomorrow or the day after, uh, see if there's, we can get the swelling down, if there's any swelling, and then get him to a doctor. Um, but uh, as at this point, he's going to be out at least a few days, maybe, you know, hopefully not, doesn't stretch into weeks or months. Can't afford to lose him. Uh, Coach, can you just talk about um, the morale of the team? Because, you know, you guys were literally seconds away from hearing that buzzer horn, and then all of a sudden Jamie falls down. What was what was the ambiance like the, the moment that happened? Well, I mean, there was a lot of concern, but, uh, you know, we were all gathered around him, and we, we didn't know what was going on. And... Uh, I just checked on him briefly in the locker room, so there really wasn't uh, an opportunity to really test the waters over there. Um, you know, he's he's such a valuable part of our team, and he's such a great teammate, and everybody loves him. So uh, we're all going to be uh, feeling bad if he's he's not able to play. But just like any other thing, you know, it's next man up. You know, but you know, our whole thing was we were going to look at bringing Maya and and. Uh, uh, Jeremiah Gray and, and, and Jamie Malonzo and let them play together and uh, see the kind of music they could play together and, and that was our big plan coming into this year and then what happens Jamie gets the, the ACL and I mean sorry uh, Maya gets the ACL and Jamie's possibly out so now we got neither of them so that that used to be a very very deep position for us and uh, now it's pretty thin but uh, again we can continue to get the kind of games we got from Ralph you know that's what we talk about in terms of the next man up uh, maybe now it's Sydney's going to have to step up we'll see Stanley stepping up some more um, that's the positions that we'll have to fill out if Jamie's not ready to go I don't think we expected it this early. Um, not certainly not when we drafted him, but we did know a lot about him. Uh, he played in our uh, in our uh, uh, PBA tour team, and he played on the the three on three. So the coaches were really excited about him. Um, uh, we knew going into that draft that that was going to be our target. We didn't have a first round pick, and we were hoping that he would last through the second into the second round. So it wasn't a pick like we were doing it just because. He played for our tour team. No, we were we were sitting on pins and needles hoping we could get him, that no one else would draft him. And no one else knew him like we did, you know. So uh, um, is it a surprise that he's playing this well? Yeah, certainly, you know, that he's playing this well. But we expected him to play well. He started our games. It's not like he's, you know, he hasn't started a game and, and, and played. He started, I think, four or five of our of our nine games or five of our six of our nine games. So uh, uh, we expect him to play well. I mean, he, he, he's not doing anything in the game that he doesn't do in practice. Put it that way. He practices like he played today. And uh, so I don't think the team is, the players itself are not that surprised that he's, but these are, I mean, triple-double, these are big numbers for anybody. So um, uh, he just kind of announced himself to the league. So I'm sure the next time out, they're going to be a little bit more conscious of him. All right, that wraps up our post-game press conference. Thank you so much, Coach Tim. Congratulations.